do this? I believe so. How is everybody? It like makes me always think of that song from the Backstreet Boys. Everybody. Yeah. Yes. Rock your body. It's time to actually not rock your body. Huh. Even unless, unless you decide that's your goal and you know intention intention for this month but it's going to be about rocking your business and your life because i am doing my favorite conversation my favorite training on really calling in the next level i'm going to do it in a way hopefully that's going to be short sharp to the point but you know we what needs to be said needs to be said what's ever gonna whatever comes out will come out so i'm just gonna briefly share this over with the other boss queens in the group of course if you are happen to come on say hi hello good day let me know where you're tuning in from to see who we are reaching right now like i love 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 how we are or i'm calling in some super duper amazing people from new places around the world i love it i love it i love it i really do genuinely so happy and excited um to call in amazing awesome people from anywhere in the world of course um and with that in mind obviously if you're watching this at a later stage hashtag replay would be great as you can see i feel like it's a game like bring on like i feel like i'm ready to like go on the field and tackle and, and throw some balls so i'm like let's do this <laughs> um and with that in mind i think the biggest thing i want to say to you this month is obviously happy first of august what do you say pinching the punch for the first of the month and no returns now the first thing i'm going to say to you is you need to make sure that you take time every month if not even every day every week but at least every month to kind of reevaluate where you are if you're really interested in making progress, you gotta become aware of that progress. And if you're constantly like in the midst of it, doing, 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 sometimes that can, 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 can that shit can catch up on you. And I find that, you know, we, we need that time to allow ourselves to come and pause for a moment, to become present and acknowledge how far we've come, and then to kind of reevaluate, reflect, and so we can then look into, okay, great. Where am I gonna move the needle this month, right? Obviously, always making sure we're staying in alignment. We're making sure we align to that next level. And this really is what it's about. How can you align yourself to the next level, okay? How can you align yourself to the next level? First thing I'm gonna say with that is, you know, at the end of the day, one thing you may wanna take on, and I'm gonna say this with the utmost love, is please can we stop the excuses? Because your excuses, don't interest anyone right i get that we have crazy lives i get that you know this whole journey of living life on your terms remember being a soul queen who lives you know in the in in soul abundance like state energy vibration in this space of soul abundance who summons soul success i'm telling you she does not give a shit about her excuses. She will find a way to raise above her excuses. And I'm not saying that you're not allowed to have a bad day or, you know, you're gonna have moments and days where you are just not going to like be your best, perform your best, do your best, you know, because you, whatever. I mean, that's normal, that's part of the journey. I mean, it so is. But overall, let this month be the month where you get over your excuses because your excuses do not, like no one cares for your excuses. You know, if you want to actually summon soul success, you want to have a thriving freaking business empire that is here to change the world, to make your mark in the world, to actually help people with the gifts that you have, you know, create transformation, get results. Well, those people are waiting for you. They're waiting for you in the trenches. They're ready to come and work with you. But if you get like stuck in your own world of excuses of why you think you cannot do something or cannot be someone or cannot, you know, grow or get over yourself, well then I'm sorry, cut that BS because it's just a distortion. It's not real. It's just a BS story. I believe that I, I know why we're doing it. I know you're doing it. It's bringing up resistance because you may actually realize just how fucking powerful you really are. And you feel like it may cost you something, you know, giving up this extra time to work on your business, to look, 
excuse me, to learn and uncover, you know, parts of you that you're ready to release takes time and you might find, oh my God, I already don't even have enough time as it is. Okay. And you know, what if you then change and you, it might lose something else. Like you actually might like lose friends and like, God forget, forbid, you're actually going to become a wealthy motherfucker. And people are like, oh God, who does she think she is? You know, high up on her horses, whatever, talks about being happy all the time. Oh, well, you know, at the end of the day, I get it. But I'm saying to you, the first thing's going to be this month, no excuses. Get over your excuses. Your excuses, we don't, no one cares for your excuses. All we care is, how can you help me get what I want? That's all your people care about. How can I get what I want? How can you help me get what I want? That's all they care about. Okay, they want to see inspiration, motivation. They want to see how you can get results, how you show up, right? Your only job really to show up is take people on that journey. You know, surely, you know, share your story, share the milestones, give value, give value, give value, and let people know how you can, you know, how they can work with you, what kind of creation, you know, magic you can create together. And then if people resonate and they're ready to take that leap, they will come and work with you. But if you don't show up because, you know, our oh, life is too busy, or if you don't feel like, oh, I don't know what to say, or I don't know, you know, like get over that. You got to get over that. You just got to start. Okay. So let that be a little bit of a, a little whoop whoop in your butt from me with love. And then let's talk about how you can up level this month. Okay. First thing it's going to be four steps. Okay. How many steps? Okay. Four steps. The first one is about, um, reviewing. So you're going to do a review. You are going to review your last month. You're actually going to take the time and go through the month of July, because I'm telling you, when you actually pay attention to it, you're going to realize that you perhaps don't need to actually beat yourself up about it at all, or not as bad as you think. Because I think if you really look, I you know, and really look, you will find so many things that you can be grateful for, so many things that you can celebrate, so many milestones, and even if it's just little milestones, because that's all we care about. You know, there will be progress. If you would have shown up this month, if you would have, you know, done things, if you're consistently, you know, meditated, consistently journaled, consistently shared your message, consistently, you know, sold, um, you know, your packages, your services, you know, the, you know, your, your magic, then I'm telling you, there will be milestones. There will be something that you can be super proud of. And that's really important. That's really important. You know, as much as I'm kind of coming in with get the, you know, get over your excuses, I also want to say to you, make sure that you celebrate. Okay. Make sure that you celebrate. So make sure that you do a review, you know, go back and live, relive the month because we don't relive the moments. We don't get really present on, wow. Right? Like, oh my God, I actually hosted my first workshops offline. Oh my God, wow. The extraordinary um, results I got, the, 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 the testimonials I've got from the healings I've done this month. Oh my God, like, wow, right? And they're so good to, to just show you that you're doing so great. But I know what we're like. We kind of beat ourselves up because we're too easily focused on the things that we haven't achieved yet, that we're still not there yet, that we're still not really clear on the purpose, that we're still not really clear on the messaging, that we're really not not showing, not knowing how to, I don't know, do this perfect Facebook Live, or we're not selling enough. Yeah, I could come from that and be like, oh my God, I could beat myself up about it. Oh, I don't post enough on Instagram or don't work on my engagement as much or, um, you know, I'm not showing up in my German group as much as I'd like to. And I can do all of that or I can say, actually, what you've done, look at this, 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 this. I prefer to celebrate, to celebrate the milestones, to celebrate what I've already, you know, accomplished this month, because that's really what it's about. It's the progress that's going to give you motivation to keep going. Same as I posted my pictures yesterday. It's a progress that's going to really inspire me now to keep going. So the motivation and the fuel comes from progress. So give yourself the gift and do a review. Okay. Celebrate. Where, have, where can you celebrate progress? Give yourself a pat on the back, okay? Then step two is you're gonna do, you're gonna reflect. So this is where you go, okay, now as much as I'm super, super like celebrating and you know, high-fiving myself and I'm very proud of myself, I also need to be honest and I need to look and identify where have I perhaps still, you know, been playing small? Where have I not, you know, kind of following through with what I really wanted? Where am I still 
feeling like, oh my God, I'm actually not compensated. Like I'm not receiving enough money as I really feel I deserve. Or, oh, you know what? Actually, I really wanted to lose, you know, we want to lose some weight and get in great health, but I'm actually drinking way too much wine still. Okay. So you know, got to reflect. So you got to flip it on the head and you got to identify where have you still been playing small? Where are you still hiding? You know, and this is where you, you point the finger only at yourself. I do not want to hear, you know, oh, it's because of them, 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 and this, this, and that. Because the thing is, we all have this and that. We all have this and that. We all have lives. We all have responsibilities. We all have, you know, things that take our time away, that kind of try and maybe pull us away from, you know, fulfilling our dreams and our desires. You know, we other have like responsibilities and challenges and things that are outside of our control. But it's really your call to rise above it really at the end of today you know this is what it takes you know this is what it takes to truly create a life on your own terms you got to rise above the excuses you got to rise above the challenges you got to rise above right everything and anything if you truly want to make it so sometimes you got to suck it up yeah that's what i'm saying really important so it's not about beating yourself up it's just about being super honest and taking radical you know responsibility for yourself and i talked about that yesterday in three steps you know um aware acceptance awareness um alignment and action so you know you got to look at yourself and go okay let's have a little honest moment with myself and really identify where i feel like okay you know there is definitely something I want to shift. And with that, that will allow you then to go, okay, talking about aligning for that next level. Step three, you make a decision what you want to decide. Like what's the preview? You're going to preview this month. You're going to fast forward to the 31st of August and you're going to write a letter and to the universe celebrating everything that you've accomplished this month. You're going to fast forward. You're going to create a quantum leap. You're going to celebrate already. I'm so happy and grateful that this month I've literally rose above my own excuses. And because of that, I committed to showing up every day. And every day I gave my best. And every day I decided to speak my truth. And every day I decided to play um, all out. And every day I decided, you know, to just give my best. And because of that, I'm so grateful that I've managed to manifest an additional $10,000. I'm so happy and grateful that I've dropped another five kilos. I'm so happy and grateful that I'm in such a beautiful place of like being super, super honest with myself and create an amazing flow. You know, I'm so um, happy and grateful that I decided that this month I, you know, make time for some meditation and extra time for me to dig in the parts of me that are still not in alignment. Okay, that's definitely something I know I'm focusing massively this month more realignment to my new level, right? I've been called to rise up again, rise up again. So for me, this month is about realigning again. I mean, I've been working on alignment for the past 18 months in depth, and here again this month, I am realigning yet all over again, right? Hence, I'm doing obviously the three day soul active, like soul alignment activation starting next Monday in my Facebook group. So if you're not in my Facebook group, you have to be there. Free three day challenge, like an activation for three days. We're going to talk about soul alignment. So you have to be there if you're serious about summoning soul success on your own terms. Okay. Um, and then, you know, you want to fast forward, you're going to do a preview of all the things that you want to, you know, manifest and call into reality, call into this 3D reality. The fourth step, the fourth one is you decide where you want to choose to make progress. Okay. And you may want to map it out first. So you may want to, you know, do the review, bullet points, writing, you know, a stream of consciousness and celebrate and give yourself, you know, lots of gratitude. You know, then you do the reflection and you write and you identify, okay, cool. I've realized that here, actually, I feel like there's still something holding me back. Maybe there's a block, maybe there's a fear, maybe it's a level of uncertainty. Maybe I'm trying to hang on to the process too much. Maybe I'm a bit of a control freak, you know, you know, whatever it is. And that's going to allow you then to decide moving forward, right? To go, okay, well, what's the preview? What I want to, what do I want to accomplish? Do bullet points, bullet points, bullet points. Then you decide, okay, based on step two, right? What is the thing that you want to shift this month? So what progress are you going to focus on? And then step five, right? This is where you write the letter, 
okay so this is where you basically fast forward and you write the letter okay so you write the letter so you do the bullet points first you decide what you want to focus on you know what kind of progress and then you write this letter and you actually will create massive results and you will align and it's i'm not saying it's going to be super easy just because you wrote that letter but you've got to kind of claim that first and then you know you may want to read that letter every day right then you want to feel into it and you know now you have like an absolute like a guide a map to know okay i know i need to like get maybe some assistance and some help on breaking through some barriers maybe i need some help on sorting out my money stuff maybe need some help to really clear up how to position myself better or how to create better content so that i can start creating like calling in the right people who actually are ready to work with me okay and of course i'm not here i'm not gonna lie if you identify something that you know perhaps you're having a hard time you know figuring out by yourself then by all means let me know okay let me know how i can help you you know i offer vip sessions or vip days you know if you live locally we can do it in one-on-one -on -one in person we can do it online right we can get together and we can map out exactly from the inside out what's been holding you back and we can shift and find out whether it is about maybe you need a bit of clarity around the strategy in terms of how to position how to package it up how to present you know how to promote it get the get over the fear of really selling yourself because selling is a right is a sacred actually act of service if you're in complete integrity with what it is that you're selling right thank you Ingrid Ada for really instilling that in me okay but or maybe it's like no you're super super clear on what it is that you want to do and how you want to work with people but somehow you're just not creating this momentum somehow you're just not calling in the right people who want to work with you and you're finding that people don't have money to work with you or you're finding you're not really consistent in showing up and talking about how you can help people and it's maybe it you know some internal blocks maybe it's something to do with your energy maybe your vibration is just not a match maybe we need to raise your vibration heart and see how you can open yourself up to receive more with ease and grace which obviously if that is something you're interested in also i encourage you to stay tuned because later this month i am launching a two-week intensive called the art to receive like a queen right this is about releasing to receiving super 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 important because i do believe a big thing a big topic in really receiving more is we need to be able to release right talk about realign align surrender release release have trust have faith show up you know have absolute conviction and open ourselves up to receive with ease grace and flow because it doesn't have to be hard okay so that could be something that you want to focus on this month then of course like i said please stay tuned you know or if you're saying you're right i really need to learn more how to really align myself my soul so that i can live a soul alive queen as fuck life then you're free to join the three-day activation next week so there's so much for you in here so much that i feel i can help you with if that obviously resonates whichever choice let me know make sure you send me a message and just share a little bit about you you don't have to go full blind just share a little bit something you know what resonated what's coming up for you maybe you're like okay you know what sabrina absolutely you're right i really feel like i've been playing small and i really set the intention that i want to get over my excuses this month just share a little bit about it you know with myself either you know feel free to send me a message or of course continue that conversation in my facebook group okay that's it for my end i trust that you got some value out of this i know you do because this is coming straight from my soul and my heart to yours and if you're not in my facebook group then of course get your butt over there okay get your butt over there make sure you're going to be there at come monday you do not want to miss this it's going to be so juicy so amazing so freaking divine it's going to blow your mind <laughs> look at that it's going to be so divine it's going to blow your mind so all you have to do is be in my facebook group which you can find right up here you just check the bio or click on the visit group button um and of course if you are in my group remember i'm hosting a community competition a bit of a challenge a community competition and i'm really 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 asking you 
you know, genuinely to help me, you know, reach more women. I know that there are so many more women who are ready to rise. And I've really been called this, my online uh, Facebook group to really, yeah, give more love, to create more space, more connection, um, more com conversation, more of a community feel where women feel safe enough to speak up so that we can create, you know, more transformation, manifestation and more magic. And remember, I'm all about magic and I decided magic means extraordinary exceptional experiences that's what magic stands for so feel free please 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 add your girlfriends your soul besties who are ready to rise you know it's going to be the challenge is going to be an amazing opportunity i know that it really means a lot to me to have your support because i do believe if you want to go fast you go alone if you want to go far, you go together. So that's why I'm super, super grateful for your love and your support. And of course, I did say it's a competition because I'm also willing to give away three spots in my upcoming program, The Art to Receive Like a Queen, that is coming later this month. So this person, the three people, the three women who invite the most queens into our space will actually get a free spot. So that's, you know, a win-win if you ask me. So let me know what you think about it. Let me know if you're ready to get over your excuses, to kind of get over your own BS and make absolute magic happen this month. In the meantime, sending you so much love. Let me know how you go and let's continue that conversation in my Facebook group.